Hey, what's up everybody? How are all my puzzle pieces doing today? We are back here in Half-Life. Half-Life. <laughs> Half-Life 3 confirmed. Halfway. Uh, and uh, we just finished kind of, uh, we found Linda Carter. We had gone through a time warp, uh, time jump and uh, faster than light travel and it, it messed things up. So we're trying to figure out what to do. We can either Let's see, do you want to begin a briefing for the next mission? Yes. So we have we have a couple of options here. So it looks like this is uh, try to find and rescue Samuel Linkford. He was put into cryostasis at this location. So this is where we are, headquarters. We've been to these places. This is the engine room we were in and we've made our way over. So our main mission is to go get Samuel. We can also go to the storage uh, in C3Y2, search for supplies in the storage room. Squad size of two. <sighs> I have a feeling he's going to be in cryo. And if that's the case, I don't think the monster is going to mess with him. Let's go get some more stuff since we can only take two. So yeah, we're going to take Linda with us. And so pick your team members. Oh, interesting. Okay. Deploy. I took inventory here before I went into cryo sleep. Don't ask me why. But I do know what we had, uh, that we had a stack of med packs and ammo down here. We could certainly use them now. Did I make a mistake? I think I made a mistake. Can we go back? No. Oh dear. I think I made a mistake by not uh, eliminating some of our inventory. We'll have to see how this goes. Standard ammunition, got that. Let's go over here. Small cell, shield cell small. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, Linda, hopefully you've got some space. Yep, okay, good. This, this is not good. Let's do this. Let's take a look at our inventory and see if there's something we need to drop. This is for a small energy cell for immediately recharging suit shields, restores five shield points. Okay. So you know what we're gonna do? Yeah, we're gonna recycle that. Uh, we're gonna recycle you because we need the we need the space in our inventory. What about you, Morton? Uh, health pack. Stim permanently increases health by two. Warning, using more than five stim packs can cause serious side effects. That's kind of cool. Okay. Um, do we want him to kind of be our beef, our beef guy? If we want that, really... So here's what I'm thinking. Let's... We're, we're going to make Morton our... Uh, we're gonna make Morton. Can I unequip this somehow? I guess not. Okay, we're gonna. Here's what we're gonna do. As soon as we have a chance, we're gonna make Morton like our frontline man. He's gonna run up, do massive damage. Um. Ooh, but he's got. Oh man, is this is this an assault rifle or is this like a shotgun? Okay, no. He he needs to be using the carbine then because he gets uh, increased hit chance when using assault rifles. But he's going to be our frontline guy, so he's going to get the health, stuff like that. Oh, I don't know. I mean... All right, well, we're still older than the game. We've got, we've got choices that we can make, so we don't have to... We don't have to make them all now. See, here we go round the rosemary bush. The rosemary bush. The rosemary bush. And 
more than I want you in front just because you've got more health. Three doors. Well, there's certainly not an ambush waiting here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Enemy spotted. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We are gonna move you. We're gonna move you over here because there's you're not getting a shot in. That's for sure. And we're gonna move you. Boy, do we do we focus fire or do we split up? You know what? I'm, I'm, this is a little risky, but we're gonna split up. See if we can divide and conquer. All right, finish turn. And I can't see what they're doing since I don't have line of sight on them, which is just great. You thought of sh you should have thought of that before. Hey, Morton. Enough. Out of you. Enough lip. Um, let's see. So I think yeah, we're gonna have you move here. I think that's that's the best option for now. And you minus we're gonna move here, see if you can get aha! We can see holy smokes, he's way up there. A zero percent hit chance. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna move you over here then. Because we've got we got some more guys coming. So we just kind of move over in that direction, over there. Oh man. I think I just counted seven enemies. It's almost what it seems like. Maybe it was just them using multiple action points. I hope that's the case, because that's a lot of enemies. All right, buddy. Let's, uh... Oh, no, that's not what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Let's make this, uh, let's make this happen. Great. All right, um, I wonder. I can have you move back, but is that really the best thing to do at this point, or should I move you up here? No, no, we need to stick together. We need to get back and stick together because uh, with so many of those enemies, there's no way. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm gonna move you down here. Okay. There's too many of them for us to try and, and take them solo like that. So he's gonna get a. I wish I knew if 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 they were splitting their movement or if they were if there were really that many enemies because that's a lot. Can we? Oh, I'm not visible. Doggone it. Um. Let's move you up here. See if we can get some visuals. Nope. Great. Well, isn't that just great? Uh, I don't, I don't like the amount of damage that that's gonna do. So, I'm just gonna. Oh my goodness! How many hit points do you have? Okay, so there's one, two. Dear. Oh, nice. She has the shield. Sweet. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We are actually... That's... Mm. There we go. Okay. That's one down. Linda. He kind of put himself in a bad position. So what we are going to do... Oh, Schnapple. Linda, let's get you down here. That way, in case uh, Morton needs a health pack, we can get it to him. Ah. 
He's he's gonna need one. The question is, do we go small, medium, or large? Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do small. Yeah. So the okay. So we're gonna bring this up and. No, not. Oh my goodness. <sighs> okay. So uh, good to know. That um, that uses it on me, not on <laughs> not on somebody else. Doggone it! All right, yeah, you're gonna need to use. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so that was one. Attack visible target. Man, I gotta get used to the way this combat goes. Because melee does not do a whole bunch of damage. Okay, so we know we've got at least three. We've got at least three other enemies. Alright, we gotta be smart about this. Come on. Come on. What is. Retaliate. Steady shot. That's where we increase. But what's retaliate? Oh, I see. So that's kind of a, a defensive, if they hit you, you hit them back sort of thing. I tell ya. All right, 72% chance to hit. Yeah, we're gonna go for it. And we're gonna do it again. Thank goodness. This is going so well. <laughs> Run away! Ow! Yeah, okay, so that is what Retaliate does. Okay, Linda, uh, we're not gonna start with you. We're gonna start with Morton. And Morton, we're gonna have you do two shots. Or one shot. And we're gonna send you up here. And Linda, we're gonna send you over here we're gonna call it good for now. We're gonna let them come to us. Okay, so there's only two left. That's good to know. That is, oh, no ammo. <sighs> okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Linda, um, let's see. Morton, how are you doing for ammo? You're doing well. Can we, no, we can't open the door, so. Retaliate is two. Um, no, where can you go? Not a whole lot of places. Okay, Linda, here's what we're going to do. We're going to have you go all the way over here. Let you reload next, next turn. Morton, we're going to have you retaliate. Kind of be the, uh, the bait draw them in okay well that that worked the manner of speaking all right reload and now we're going to take them out here but that's our action points for that turn 57 percent chance here's what we're going to do we're going to use your steady shot Yes. Nice. Oh, wow. That was only... Okay. And then this takes five turns to get back. But still, that's... I need to remember I have that. It's okay, Morton. It's okay. Retaliate. Okay. Well, first of all, Linda, smoke this guy, please. Thank you. And then let's... Oh, no ammo. Good to know. Load. Take it out. 
Ha ha ha. Let's see. You have no action points. You have one left. Now, I wonder if he still retaliates. I wonder if that's a full turn. Doesn't matter. That seems to be it. Let's grab what we can use and get out of here. The door up there leads to a shortcut. Let's move. That door. No, I do not want to leave. I want to keep exploring this area, definitely. Okay, here. so here's some of my... Uh, some of my little... Aspie nature. Just gotta open all the doors, make it all even and pretty and stuff. Let's see. Scout suit, standard ammunition. Plasma grenade. Sounds nice. No! Okay, so let's let's do this. Let's take a look at the scout suit here. Gives no armor, but gives massive shields. Scout suits MK1 were developed for fast-moving scout troops by utilizing the latest in shield technology. These suits are light and don't rely on heavy armor materials. So it seems like... I mean, it doesn't have any armor, but it has a huge, huge amount of shield. And it takes less time to recharge and it adds agility which i think is what is what adds to uh your movement like you can move more spaces using only one action point when you've got a higher agility we're gonna we're gonna give it to morton for now and then we're gonna recycle your your overalls there the standard ammunition here. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to do some serious consideration on how we want to outfit people moving forward. Another scout suit. Okay, that's good because I think we're gonna be getting a new crew member here pretty soon. What have we got in here? F what? That looks cool. Do we have any other doors that we can go into? Can we go into this door? No. What about up here? Doesn't look like it. I think that's it. We should head out and look for Sam. Let's talk to Linda, just make sure everything's okay. We need to go. Sam is still out there. You're right, Linda. We do. We have... Uh, Taking our sweet time, but we need to get out there. Okay, so let's let's do this. We've got a lot of standard ammunition we could probably store. I think we we might just need two. We'd store quite a bit. And then Linda. Oh wait. Am I able to get to Linda's inventory from here? I can. Okay, good. Linda's got another scout suit. We may want to keep that. Let's take a look at this. Flat gun mincer. <laughs> Magazine of four. Usually engineers are close combat secondary weapon for officers. Light, easy to use, and deadly. The weapon is called mincer for good reason. I mean, it's got a higher magazine, but it's all around... I mean, it's only the Mark One. Maybe that has something to do with it. I wonder how it would compare with just the regular pacifier. <sighs> I think what we're gonna do we're gonna store the shield cell small. Yeah. And the flat gun for now. We'll give the scout suit to um, Sam, assuming he's still alive. And then, let's see. Open shop. Ammunition. Med kits. 
shield cells, grenades. Okay, so I can I can buy some stuff, but I only have 87 credits at this point. I have only 87 space bucks. Oh, okay, that's the shop down there. So I can I can also hit the buttons up here to do the same thing. Okay. Good to know. Well, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Um with this series, we may just do uh, a mission per episode. We'll see kind of what the time looks like. If it's not a whole lot, then, then maybe we'll do a couple missions an episode. But uh, yeah, so we, we were able to kind of resupply a little bit, get some armor and weaponry that will help out. And now we need to go look for Sam because we need to rescue everyone we can and figure out what is going on on this ship. I mean, who are these weird, like, cyborg brainiac sort of zombie guys and what's going on uh anyway uh if you liked it give me a like if you dislike the video give me a dislike question of the day is if you could be either the scout you know you're fast you're running around uh a lot more but maybe not quite have as much health and maybe not do as much damage or you were kind of the you were the the meat shield you would just, you know, be uh, the one absorbing all the damage, taking all the hits, um, and uh, and did damage, but didn't necessarily. Well, actually, I think it's the other way around. You didn't do a lot of damage, but you took a lot of hits. Or are you the one that's doing a lot of damage but can't take a lot of hits, but you're running around more? Let me know in down below. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.